Previously on Hardline. That's Leo Ray. He says he has information regarding the drug war that's plaguing Miami. I had everything on flatter, and you fucked it up. You sure like fucking oh. You're both excellent at improvising and terrible about keeping things quiet. What the hell just happened? You wanted to see me, sir? Mendoza, have a seat. Let's change things up for you, too. Relax. He's not going to make you direct traffic. Well... Not yet. So Leo, our good friend, he told us what he knew and he walked right out the door. He came in for protection, I thought. Tell Nick what Leo gave up. Drug bails. You're shitting me. Planes go up, drugs come down. Plop. Right into the Everglades. Show him. A fishing map. Whose operation is this? Some ship bird named Remy Neltz. Two years ago, this Neltz character was nothing. A blip on the radar. Now, he runs the entire operation that employed Tyson Latchford. Sounds like a man of ambition. Yes, he does. I want you two to wade into that mud hole we call a national park and find out just how ambitious he is. Sir, why would Leo rat on his boss and then just walk out into the open? Well, Leo said he didn't feel safe around cops anymore. We're done. Actually, Mendoza, stay a minute. Of course. Your partner can be a bit of a hothead. Well, she believes in what she's doing, sir. <laughs> Good answer. Sit down, son. There are going to be some complaints about the Elmore. Excessive force, etc., etc. Don't worry about it. I'll handle it. Well, we appreciate that. Hmm. Thank you, sir. How's your mother, Detective? Sorry, sir. Your mother? I'm sure she went through a lot to get you out of Cuba. <laughs> you don't become a detective, especially at your age, without a thorough background check. And you have a lot of background to check. Sir, it's all right. I know what it's like to have a shithead for a father, too. It took me a long time to find my way. And you? You're on the right path, son. Stay on it. Jesus Christ, Leo's map is confusing. The scale is all wrong, but I think this is it. Leo just gave Dawes that map. Just handed it over. Handed over an unbelievably shitty map. Yeah, but what's in it for him? That's what I don't understand. Well, he's obviously being pressured by someone or something. Whoever's dropping these bales, Leo wants us to know about it. So we can take out his competition, right? Leo knows he's done in Miami. I had to guess, he's probably setting up a meth lab in Iowa right about now. What the hell were you thinking anyway, beating him up like that? Leo had an attitude problem. And we could have had an internal affairs problem. There's our girl. Take us toward the drop. Narcos track their bales by radio. The number on Leo's map must be the frequency. And look at that. We got a pig. Get me close enough to a bale and I'll tag it with the tracking dart. That way when someone comes to pick these things up, we'll know exactly where they go. You know, back when the cartels ran their drugs through Miami, these swamps were filled with smugglers. Maybe history's repeating itself. <laughs> Let's hope not. Back then, cartel guys were gunning each other down at their kids' birthday parties. Yeah, I remember. I was just a kid back then, but I saw some crazy shit. Blood on the sidewalk, pit bulls with your throat slashed. How the hell did your mom keep you out of all that shit? Well, it's gonna sound a little corny. She worked hard. And she loved me. Yeah, that sounds pretty goddamn corny. <laughs> Mama's boy. <laughs> Never would have guessed. Tagged it. Now let's see where it goes. And we got another pig. 
Lead on, partner. There's at least 10 kilos in that bale. Americans love their drugs. My point is, this is not a small operation. Dawes wouldn't have us out here if it was. To say the cartels are using Miami to move product again, how would they do that? My best guess? Mexico's gotten way too scary. The average smuggler will risk prison but not having his head chopped off by some Zeta. <laughs> Americans do love their drugs. Hey, it's a big deal that Dawes put us on this, you know that, right? Oh, I know. Problem is, the stuff we're doing we can't exactly bring to a DA. Who gives a shit? This is way more fun. By the way, Captain Dawes, that guy was reckless as hell when he was young. Yeah, I heard that about him. It's just a risky way to work, that's all. Word of advice. You want to get on the Captain's good side? Take the gloves off. Oh, is that what this is? Bare knuckle police work? Now you're catching on. near that parachute. Okay, I'll pull up to the dock. A lot of gators out here. Yeah, I wouldn't sweat it. They're more afraid of us than we are of them. Just say thanks. Okay. Thanks. Maybe we should stick to the trail. <sighs> More afraid of us than we are of them, huh? Let's just get out of the water. We gotta get up to that platform. Try this grappling hook. I borrowed it from SWAT. Ever used one before? No. Launch the hook at the platform. <laughs> Did the narcos build these things? No. They're old observation platforms. For tourists. You good guy? How's your shoulder? It hurts like hell, actually. Here, brought a zip line, too.
You did come prepared. Aim for those planks. They'll make a good anchor. Bullseye. Okay. Follow me down. What's your scanner showing? Hi, we got company. Shit. They must be the pickup crew. At least it's not a total mess. Police, you're under arrest. We're clear. Looks like that bail missed the target. Got a frequency for you. 120.13. See anything? Whoa. Look at all those pretty points of light. All up and down the lake. Well, let's take their boat and go check it out. Call this in? We're not exactly in our jurisdiction here. Let's find Nelts first. He's more ambitious than I thought. Shitbags always are. You know the thing that scares me the most about the Shrub War? Whoever wins will have a lot of money and a lot of guns. Yeah, when they're done with each other, they're gonna come after us. The 80s all over again. Which is why Gauls wants to stop this now, before it gets to that. So if we're off the book, I'm not arguing. Then why don't you sound like this? Because what's the end game? Put the big boys away, the kingpins, and make it stick. You need a lot more than guns. I don't know. Do you? You're playing a dangerous game, detective. Give a scan before we go. Got an Allen wrench? Any luck with that thing? I think it fixed itself. You need at least one 
more fanball by the weekend. Are you a tour? Scan for any alarms. Keep it up production. That alarm will call more of them in unless you disable it. We can go into the car. You're calling. Dig Remy's doing all right. But you can't do this forever. There's a lot of guys in there. What's the call? Let's move in. Why? What happened to Tyson? Tyson got lost in the details. Besides, not getting caught is exactly why Nels has happened to this big thing. Remy thinks this big bad wolf is gonna help him keep his house together. And I got some sparkling swamp art in the cellar. Freeze! MP- Last gen tech. Those things must get a signal out here. Guy was supposed to go to a stadium for a meet later. The closest stadium is back in Miami. Yeah, I don't think that's what this means. Well, time to move on. Okay, back to the boat. If the cartels are using the blades again, it makes sense. It's big, empty. Look, all we need to do right now is find Nels. You think Nels is working with the cartels? Uh uh. Cartels have their own pipelines. This, this is someone else. What do you know about Nels? Rich family, dropped out of film school. Got to start trying to fund a movie with drug money. Let me guess. He forgot to make the movie. No, he made it. Some gas.
Kai. I gotta ask you about something. What's up? You. Tyson. No. That. Well, you know, a girl occasionally goes on dates. You dated Tyson? Look, I met him at a party. We had one date. Well, two. Two official dates. Wait, wait, wait. wait. You dated a cocaine dealer. Cocaine broker. So when did he find out you were a cop? When I found out he was a cocaine broker. Look, believe it or not, he's not a bad guy. this place no idea head up by the windmill and let's get a bird's eye probably a few different ways we can take this it's a church on sunday and ed's coming with me brennan wouldn't miss it all right listen up we got a buyer coming in Meeting's just breaking up. They're fanning out. Get in a little closer. Gator farm. That's clever. I'll give him that. <sighs> yeah. Hey, Tommy, Tommy, pick it up, man. You know the rules. Somebody at the radio at all times. It's Arnell's disguise. Here, no, talk to them. Shut up, Rick. Can't get Tommy. No! Hey. Yeah, yeah, it's all good. I'm here. Who the fuck is this? It's Antonio. Where's Tommy? Yeah, um, uh, he's taking a shit. <sighs> nice. Oh, yeah? Well, tell him that Nelson said it's time for the meet. Okay, where's he headed? Tommy knows where the fuck he's going, Antonio. Tell him we're on our way. Boring conversation anyway? The meeting on that guy's phone? That's with Nelts. 
He said they were headed... Miami Aquatic Stadium's been shut down for a while. That's where they gotta be meeting. Well, we're not gonna find it here. Police! You're under arrest! Who's this guy? Who the fuck? Fuck this I guy! <laughs> the stadium's just south of here. Hold tight. Yeah, I remember when I was a little kid, I came here once. Had a motorboat pulling ten girls in a pyramid. And they were like on that side of the lake, and then there was a boat pulling tight. That was weird. When's the meeting? The guy's running late. Hey, well, what's that? <clears throat> Fuck! What is that?
Nels, get your hands up! Keep them up! Uh, Mendoza, right? Save it! I took Stardust's deal. You got some fucked up friends, Mendoza. Wait, what deal? I'm a ghost to you. You hear me? Damn it! I'll call in a chopper. We'll find him before he gets far. The place doesn't have many windows, so smoke should be effective. I want a three-man team going in here, and another here. Snipers, here, and here. Looks like Stoddard's got it all under control. Fuck that. We had him first. Okay. You want to make sure it's locked first, Hacha? Huh. Finally catch a break. Going in. Fuck you are. See if your boys can take the heat off of us. Right down, right down! We got this, Sergeant. I said we got this! Ty, what the hell are you doing? <sighs> We have back up and route. anything.
Die, you find anything. Look out! We're on the third floor! Shoot him! Nothing yet! Securing perimeter. We'll have breach in position momentarily. on that front door. down and we can talk about Stoddard this deal whatever else you want what the hell was that Stoddard Looks like I just saved your life Mendoza he was surrendering even alone partner I say you were in danger right he was dangerous because he was talking about your deal leave it alone the hell I will no 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 I'm curious what did Nels say something interesting Nick we're done here now listen to your partner she's a smart lady here before evidence arrives You're kidding. There you go, Nick. Congrats on a job well done. Smart lady. Now I see why. <laughs> 